FIP is a disease we most commonly see in young cats and it occurs as a result of a mutated form of a intestinal coronavirus, so not COVID, different kind of coronavirus. Cats often get exposed to this coronavirus. It's something that many cats get, but sometimes within a specific cat, it mutates or transforms into FIP, so within that individual cat itself. So FIP is not transmissible between cats directly, the coronavirus is, but not FIP. It has to transform within that individual cat to cause that disease. Many cats who have FIP develop effusions, so that means fluid accumulation within their belly or their chest, so they may get a really distended looking belly, or they may have trouble breathing from the fluid around their lungs. We call this wet FIP, but they can also get a different form of FIP called dry FIP, which means that it affects other organs in their body and does not cause all this fluid accumulation. That usually involves disease with the lymph nodes, you can get changes to the eyes, or even brain symptoms as well. FIP is a disease that's been occurring for a really long time and it did not have any good treatment options readily available for many, many, many years. Lots of research was happening, but not a lot of treatments were available that were able to be prescribed by veterinarians. Luckily, over the past couple of years, we've had a medication become available that veterinarians can prescribe called GS441524, which is a huge mouthful, um, but that's a medication we can specifically prescribe through various compounding pharmacies, and this is a miracle drug. It really works for a lot of these cats. Most cats who go on this medication are magically hugely improved within a few days of starting the drug and within a few weeks are pretty much back to normal. Occasionally we do have cats who don't respond to the medication, which is always really sad, but many cats do and it can really save lives and be curative for them. Before this medication, this disease was considered universally fatal, meaning all cats who got this disease died from it. So now that we have a way to prescribe this medication, we can save lives, which is such a great feeling.